In this video, I'll show you how to download and use free images, videos and music in Kden Live. Welcome to this video. My name is David and I hope you're well wherever you are around the world. So, I'm inside Kden Live. And if I look at the version that I'm using, it's Kden Live version 22.04.2. So, that's out of the way. Uh, that is, if you're using older versions, you may need to try and up uh, update uh, your Kden Live. So, uh, by default, sometimes the online resources tab is available to your right. But if you've closed it out, then this is how to get it back. When you're inside the project pin, right click inside here and click on online resources. When you click on that, the new dialog box that pops up up here is the online resources for Kden Live. And with a couple of services available for you to get free images, videos and music. So. If I click on this drop down, we'll see this free sound and this I believe is freesound.org, Internet Archive Movies, Pexels Photos, Pexels Videos, Pixabay Photos. Now this comes in handy especially when you're working on a project and you don't have the right footage uh, that is a stock media uh, to use. So let's say we want a Pexel video. Uh, the next thing you need to do is you need to search for whatever you want. Let's say you want uh, a video or a clip of uh, of a of maybe a dog. Uh, let's say of a dog and click on such. That is by pressing on enter. It's going to pass a couple of items here, and it would be awesome to see the different videos and be able to scan uh, through. But what you'll see is you'll see uh, who created that particular video and the size and the duration, which is really awesome. You can see the next one the next one and let's assume you want this particular one now once you select it you can click on preview to see how it looks like and it may take a while because obviously it's online and also depends on your internet connection so here we go we're inside the uh, online resources and that is what that particular uh, video looks like if it's something that you wanted uh, to use then you can do that and to do that all you need to do is just click on import and once you click on that please choose the version you want to download that's a pop-up you're going to get and let's assume you want to download the hd 1080 by 1920 click on that and then click on ok now just look at a couple of things here be aware that usage of the resource is maybe restricted by license terms or law do you want to add license attribution to your project notes if you can want that, you can do that. Let's say, let's just say no. I don't want, and then choose where you want to save your video. Click on save, and the video is going to start downloading onto your computer, uh, more or less, where you've decided you want that particular video uh, to actually go. So uh, you, you can decide, click OK, documents, but it also, no profile found for your clip create and switch new profile there's no issue about that uh, just cancel so these are video uh, that we just downloaded and you can just drag and drop it inside here so if we play it we can actually just close the online resources for now you'll see that now in our main preview window here if we scrub through the timeline you can see that particular dog right there so that is the first option just go to online resources again Let's get that tab then we can say free sound uh, let's see what we get from this it's already starting to pop up uh, the sounds for dogs let's say we want barking dogs so you can preview but remember you'll need to see CC by 3.0 just go and see what all this means but let's import uh, and login is required for this so uh, I don't think I'll, I'll need to do that Let's just close that. Uh, I don't want to log in. Let's go look for Pixabay photos. Let's also look for dogs. Let's search for, for that as well and see what we get. Let's see. We want this particular one. Uh, as for this one, there's no preview, but you can just click on import. So be aware of the usage and license. Uh, just make sure you know what this means. Just click on yes. Uh, no, I don't want to save the, the notes. Sorry. Import. No. 
I just want to save the image. Uh, it's done. Okay. And it appears here. So that's the image uh, that we just downloaded. And if we close this, you'll see the image now that is on our timeline here. And you can make any animations uh, that you want to it uh, using the different effects for the transform. Actually, you can just do insert an effect, transform. And then let's say right about here, we can add a keyframe and then we can adjust the size and then we can adjust the position. Uh, let's say we go for something like, let's say the X axis. Mm, it moves like that. The Y axis should probably move the other way. Uh, this way as well. So let us see what we get for that particular piece. But zooms in and then looks like that. So you can literally just pop in uh, media from online resources inside KDN Live and then make the different animations that you want. Just remember uh, the issue about the licensing might come in handy to avoid any copyright infringement. But that is how you can download and use free videos, images and audio or music or sound effects in KDN Live. Thanks for watching this video. My name is David and until next time, stay safe and never stop learning.